Track Brewery. So it's You go, I go, you say, I say, one song, two sing. Pointed in the right direction or um, but they'll sit down, go over all the flavor profiles with us, how to what flavors we're looking for. Check out this new ad, guys. For the coaching program. It's not focusing. Oh, man. All right, I'm pretty hungry. The past couple days, I've noticed my hunger and my cravings have increased dramatically, so that's a good sign. That means I'm well deep into this cut that if I continue to stay hungry and have these cravings and stay on track, it's going to be significant difference when it comes to my body composition. Like, I'm going to wake up leaner by the day. But yeah, I'm about to eat my next meal, but I have to jump on a Facebook uh, live that I scheduled for today at 2 p.m. It's 1.53. Um, it's on the private Facebook group for the new program. Uh, that's another that's another incentive of, of signing up for the, the coaching program app is uh, there's a private Facebook group that I started where all of us get to go on there and just motivate and inspire, educate everybody, and just, just, just kind of come together as like a, a family, right? Just to be just to be positive and encourage each other and seeing everybody on the grind. I think I think to me, seeing others on the grind and excited about it is what motivates the shit out of me. All right, Facebook Live was sick. A lot of you guys jumped on, it was fun. I'm gonna do it every Tuesday, 2 p.m. Lunchtime, Kung Pao Chicken, which is bomb if you guys haven't tried it yet. 50 Yangs, I've been showing it on the channel, on my Instagram, 50 Yangs, they have the Kung Pao Chicken, the Orange Chicken, Teriyaki Chicken. In my opinion, just as good or even better than Panda Express. A lot of times Panda Express is not that good because it's freaking not fresh, but I'm telling you. And then I'm gonna try the Built Bar. I'm excited. I wanted to show you a new toy. You guys are probably like, oh, you already have one. I do. I was using the 5K, which is the massive one. Super big. It was too big even for this camera. My setup is pretty big. Big lens, big camera. But the 5K was just overkill and it was just a lot to carry. So the 3K is a little a step down. Let me show you. Yeah, see this? This is the 5K. Thing is massive. It's so big. It's like a regular tripod. And my supplements, counterclockwise. The top one is B12. Second one is uh, zinc. Third one is D3. Fourth one, that is vitamin C, 3,000 milligrams. I usually just do two thousand but I'm doing three thousand lately um, I've just been hearing too many people just having COVID around me so I haven't got it I think maybe I've had it already and I have antibodies in my system but just to be safe and then fish oil and then ghost uh, the last one ghost uh, multivitamin Let's see what's up to YouTube dude what's up YouTube it's been a while pre-workout for push day heavy push day Two scoops of uh, Ghost Pump. And Ghost Energy. All right, and we're gonna do the regular one scoop of BCAs, Ghost BCAs. Uh, this is a watermelon uh, Sour Patch. I've been pretty consistent on my BCAs intra, and I think it's really been helping my, my recovery. But, in my opinion, BCAs, aminos, all that stuff is still, to me, a luxury supplement. You don't need it, it's not necessary, but they definitely have uh, benefits. That's actually really, that's very good. That's literally right. All right, doing a little soft tissue work, just uh, foam rolling my lats and my chest, and then we're gonna get started on bench. All right, this is my last acclimation set before my working sets. The program calls for uh, uh, three sets, six, eight, ten, 
Uh, six reps, I'm shooting for 275, so we'll get a good feel of you know how, how good I'm feeling today with a 245. We'll probably do two reps. Green shot at this. You see something wrong, wrong with it? I did that? Yes, that's it. That's how a set of six is supposed to look like. Second working set, I was able to hit 265 for a set of eight, which was uh, pretty surprising. So last set, last last working set, 245 for 10. Alright guys, push workout complete, it was a pretty good one, a good amount of weight and uh, I'm pretty, pretty pumped. So. Pop! Don't show. Is it dope? Is it dope? I'm down. Is it dope? Hey, say hi. Say hi to YouTube. Hi. <laughs> Mickey's house? Mickey's house. We went to Dum Dum Disney. Hi. Beepy. <laughs> Beepy soak. Okay. Got you. <laughs> Finishing off my macros with a little rice chicken bowl. It's the same Kung Pao that I had earlier. Mm. Little hack here. I got the one cup of white rice. And then this whole packet of uh, cauliflower rice, which is only, for the whole thing, you're looking at 12 grams of carbs. And that's it. So it tricks you to feel like you're having more rice. Hot. It's hot? Yeah, don't touch it. Hot. So look at that whole, whole bowl. It's full. I'm going to throw a little seasoning on it. It's uh, Icon Meals, vodka, uh, lemon pepper. Hey, Pop Pop. You pop. <laughs> You're gonna come to work with me today? Yeah. Are you gonna be a good boy? I'm money safer. You got a money? A money. Oh, let me see. How much? Let me see it. It's a red mouth. Let me see it. Let me see your money. Don't put you don't put it in your mouth. It's dirty. It's dirty. Oh. It's dirty money. You got a dime. Save it. 
late start today, but I got a lot done. I was actually just chilling in bed, checking emails and doing some um, edits on, on some for some content for my Instagram and Facebook. Productive morning. I was just chilling. Look at, look at the hair. Look at how long it is. This is the longest my hair's been on this channel. Pretty sure. No, but I mean, I'm intentionally growing out the top, just having it chopping, just messy look. But um, the, the bottom, usually I have a skin fade, like a skin taper fade. And uh, I haven't been able to get a haircut for over a week and a half because uh, my boy Nick, he got he got the vid, he got the vid. But he's he's at home and he's like perfectly fine. He said he had a like cold like symptoms, but then he like kicked it that first couple days. But he has to quarantine for 14 days. Uh, that's that's the rules. So yeah, he's he's stuck in bed. I just got off the phone with him, Facetime, and uh, he's cool. He's good. He's good. He's he's like ready to get back to work already, but he doesn't want to, you know, spread it. But hopefully you can see that texture. I really like it. It's a little work to get it, you know, to, to put product in it. But actually, it's pretty quick. I use this uh, powder and um, uh, this uh, matte like pomade to kind of finish it off. But mostly the the powder. It gives it that dry, just messy bedhead look. All right, so here is my lunch and dinner. So Sonia just cooks the, uh, preps the chicken, the 50 Yang's chicken, and then I just cut in half and then throw it in Tupperware, and then one cup of rice. So that is my meal prep. It's not meal prepping. <laughs> it's super convenient though, tasty. So along with my multivitamin, this is my stack for immune system health. Fight this COVID, make sure you know I don't catch a cold or I, I, I have a strong enough immune system to freaking fight COVID if I get it. Or just overall, just avoid it. Wellness formula. You can get this at Sprouts or like, I think Trader Joe's. It's not at Walmart or Target or anything. Vitamin C and zinc. What are you reading? Book. A book. Morning. It's not even morning anymore. It's mm -hmm. almost afternoon. Let me see your jersey. Dodgers. Turner. Doggy. Fun fact, the first sport that I played as a kid was baseball. Or actually t-ball and then baseball. I got into basketball way later. And then basketball led me to hitting the weights. You want to watch some Netflix? Cutest in the galaxy. That's a cool shirt. Nice Prestos. These are the Presto Reacts, like Daddy's. He loves those ones. Angry Birds. Angry Birds? Angry. He's like... He sleeps with us still, and I cuddle with him every night, and he's just getting so big so fast. It, it like, it, it's fun to see, but then again, it makes me sad. Like, he's just he's grown up so, too fast. And, I mean, with me working all the time, you know, running multiple businesses, it's like, I'm, I'm, I'm home often, more often than probably someone working, like, a, a, a corporate job. But, I mean, up here, I am, I'm not... 100% always there, you know, I'm always thinking work, business, um, things that I need to do, and being an entrepreneur, it just doesn't stop. Your thoughts, your emotional energy is just not always there, and I, I am able to kind of identify it and then talk about it, and I just know what I need to do, and, and my goal right now is to scale my businesses and earn more time. More time being with my family, just more time being focused more on, on life and just enjoying it. Because we all get caught up working. And if you're not working smart, if you're not putting your money to work, then you're going to be working forever. So my main, main piece of advice is when you first, eat, if you're going to start a business, if you're going to be an entrepreneur, always keep that, 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 that thought in your head, that focus on putting your money to work and not working to the death of you. 
I mean, you got to work. In the beginning, there's you got to be in the dirt. You got to play. You got to play in the dirt. You got to just grind. You got to you got to struggle a little bit. But later in the, down the road, you just got to focus on on scaling your business and and working smarter. Daddy duty. I got him this iPad mini a while back and we kind of took it away because he was just on it. He was just consumed by it, but I want to let him use it. Here and there, when we're you know, just at least when we're at restaurants, when he, when he just can't sit still and he wants to go crazy and play, but uh, he locked it. It's disabled. I think I tried this a while back and it was just uh, it wasn't working. But I'm gonna try it again. So we're making some progress. Bucket. It says. Bucket iPad recovery mode. So it's it's uh, downloading an update and then it's gonna restore it and then update it. All right, Daddy did it. Is it fixed? I'm Man, he's been freaking moving around iPads and our iPhones like since he was like freaking less than a year old. All right, we're ordering a little Raymond some McDonald's. You want chicken nuggets? You want McDonald's? You hungry? Hey, your food is here. Look what we got. You hungry? There you go. What's in there? Happy meal. I got you a milk and a juice. Apple juice, okay? Enjoy, man. You ready to go? I gotta take you home and Daddy's gonna Get some back. Pull day, pull day, baby. All right, we made it to the gym. Dropped off the little man. There he is. My bad, dude. What's up, dude? I had to drop off. Little guy. No He's all freaking sleeping. He passed out. All right, we got pull-ups. So obviously we're gonna have to do them weighted 668. Brought the, the, the belt from home. I actually got that thing for Sonya for Christmas so I can use it too. <laughs> Dave hasn't done pull ups in like five years. Thought he wouldn't be able to do them. Yeah. It's like when you uh, put your uh, shoes on. Which shoe do you put on first? Or your socks and shoes? Doesn't matter. Mine's always the right. I try to change it up and it feels weird. It's interesting. It's one of the things that I, I don't know, don't have a routine or OCD about. It's whatever one's closest. Yeah. Yeah, feels good. Six, six, eight on the pull grip lap, lap pull down. Six was pretty juicy. That was pretty heavy, heavier than we usually go on the on that stack. Come on. Heated row pull grip. Uh, we did six, six, eight. Well, now this set is eight. So uh, I went two hundred, which is pretty heavy for for this movement for me. I'm gonna go 180 for eight, just dropping it uh, one plate.
time. The common question is how, how much time do I take in between sets? And my answer is pretty, pretty universal and generalized. It's uh, just take as much time as you need to recover so you don't miss any reps and you don't have to decrease the weight for your next working set. I say the sweet spot for most people, three to five minutes. If you want to turn it up and just work on your overall just recovery in between sets to challenge yourself, then decrease the rest time, one to two minutes. You're obviously not gonna be able to use a, a high load, but you're gonna train yourself to, to buffer out your lactic acid to recover in between sets. I started with the 80s, the 90s, and uh, those were pretty juicy. Perfect set of eight for me right now. I don't ever recommend weighing yourself at the gym fully clothed with a big ass camera in your hands. I always recommend weighing yourself uh, in the morning, butt naked, after you go to the bathroom, nothing in your stomach, fasting. But here, I see people, here on the scale, you know, after work, after like two, three meals, water, everything, fully clothed, and they're like, they get their weight. I call that weight, not your true weight, but your fight weight. Because if you ever got in a fight, if you've ever been in a fight, you know, it's later on in the day, because we have a couple meals and we have water, you're full, hydrated, you're heavier. Here you go. 177.4 is my fight weight. I think it's a funny term. So like, if you were gonna fight me, I would be 177 pounds, not a buck 50. All right guys, almost forgot to end the vlog, but I'm gonna end it here. Thank you for watching, as usual, hit the like button, share, Subscribe if you haven't already and also turn on your notifications if you haven't already so you don't miss any videos any uploads I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace You go, I go You stay, I stay One song, you sing